when a hydrogen atom going from n equal to 2 to n equal to 1 n equal to 2 to n equal to 1 hydrogen atom is going like this it emits a photon of course it will release the energy its recall speed is x by 5 means if photon travel in this direction recoil speed means hydrogen atom is going in this direction and speed of the hydrogen atom is given by x by 5 meter per second that is the value of the x we all know everything is happening due to the internal force no external force is acting so when f external is zero we all know very well momentum is conserved or constant it means initial momentum equal to final momentum initial momentum is zero because system is stationary or at rest Final momentum both are moving opposite direction so I can say momentum of the photon and momentum of the hydrogen atom in opposite direction or we can say momentum of the photon is given by momentum of the hydrogen atom. For the photon we know very well E equal to PC so P is given by E by C so momentum of the photon is E by C or delta E by C. Then momentum of the hydrogen atom that is mass into velocity so recoil speed is given by delta E upon MC. What is the value of the delta E that is the energy gap between n equal to 1 and n equal to 2 is 10.2 electron volt so a delta is 10.2 electron volt convert into the joules it is 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 joules divided by mass mass is given to us that is 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 27 kilogram and speed of the light is 3 into 10 to the power 8 meter per second we will further solve it so we will see 1.6 is cancelized and this is 10.2 so you can write it 102 into 10 raised to power this is 0.2 minus 20 then it is 3 into 10 raised to power 27 and this is 8 that is 10 raised to power minus 19 so finally it is given by v equal to 102 upon 3 into 10 raised to power minus 1 or you can say 102 upon 30 so it further we will solve it is 3 3 ja 9 3 4 ja 12 and that is 10 then further it is 2 17 here it is 5 so 17 by 5 now you compare with x value is 17 so right answer of this problem is 17